Friendly Neighborhood Gamer here and welcome back to another video. In today's video we are going to be going over a nice little spot that you can farm early on. This is for those mid game to low level players who need to farm something early on and don't want to get into the harder areas. So with that said I want to keep this intro as short as possible that way I do not waste your time. So let's get straight into the video. So you might have seen this one already, but this one is going to be the Bear Tribe Refugee campsite that we're going to be going to. Now this has a special mission at the end where you're going to go into a dungeon and take out some enemies, and it's usually only a one-time thing. So in order to get to this last side quest that is provided by the Chieftain, what you need to do is complete some of the side quests that are available in the camp, and then it will progress you towards talking to the Chieftain, and then he will take you to that dungeon, and that is where we need to be. And I do want to say, sadly, if you have already completed this quest, you cannot go back and do it unless you create a new character and go through the story again. However, it might be worth it if you do one of your alt characters on this nice little side quest in order to level your character up pretty easily. So once you finally have talked to the Chieftain, what you guys are going to do is he's going to come with you and you're going to go to this dungeon on the map. This is the dungeon that we need to go to and this is the one that we can repeat over and over for XP. So once you get to this dungeon, what we're going to do is just go inside and then of course we're going to clear all the enemies in the area. Now what I like about this a lot is that there is going to be a ton of elite enemies that spawn which gives you a nice amount of XP. I think a lot more elite enemies spawn in this dungeon compared to other dungeons when you're at a lower level, so this makes for a nice little XP farm. Now I will say that you probably won't get a ton of legendaries on this farm. I did get a few, but not a ton compared to others. But this is a really great, just solid XP farm, and it's really great for you low level players and mid level players to level up your character. And like I said in my other video, I'm only playing at world tier 1. Of course you want to jump up to world tier 2 or 3. But I am just trying to level up this character and understand the playstyle of this character a little bit more before I progress into the later world tier levels. And once you've pretty much cleared the cave and you get to this boss right here, what you're going to do is pick up the object and then it's going to take you to the main boss fight. And of course from there what we're going to do is then leave the dungeon and then back out of the game, get back into the game and then head into the dungeon again to reset all the enemies. So you don't actually have to do what I did here and actually put the object on the pedestal to go through the gates. Once you get to the gates you can actually just leave the dungeon and then of course quit out of the game and get back in and it will reset. And it's as simple as that. Let me know if you guys have any questions. I'll leave the video going for a little minute just so you can see some of the gameplay and footage of going through the dungeon. Let me know again if you do have any questions. Thank you so much for watching and we'll catch you next time. Be on guard. This glacier has claimed many of my bravest warriors.
energy. Hit the damn subscribe button already.